Okay, I had one question. One question, and I think I know the answer to it. Is uh, anybody want me to do Lightroom reviews on uh, training tips and tips? tips and tricks. Last time I did uh, stuff like that ages ago, people... <laughs> There's so much training material out there on Lightroom. And, you know, half of it anyway is really good. The other half of it sucks ass. Um, but does anybody want me to do training videos on Lightroom? Um, last I recall, people did, <laughs> people did want me to do it. Um... Some people don't even use Lightroom. I'm like, wow, really? Okay. Um, oh, also, uh, Adobe reports uh, two important things. Adobe has totally ditched um, uh, their uh, their uh, regular uh, non-creative cloud service. Like we were able to buy the uh, Creative Suite. Excuse me, their uh, CS or Creative Suite. Adobe has ditched that as of like 12 days ago or something like that. Um... They are gone, have gone all now to uh, Creative Cloud. Adobe reports massive record revenue uh, increase of nearly $6 billion last year. So last year, Adobe made a profit of $5.85 billion. Really smart move on Adobe's part, switching to Creative. It's just like a subscription service right now. You know how you used to like, I don't know, you subscribe to like Wine of the Month Club and they send you a bottle of crap wine every month. I never do that. I don't drink. Um, so now it's just kind of like an expensive magazine subscription. You know, for $10 a month, you know, you get Photoshop and Lightroom and you get constant updates. Uh, as of when I got my new MacBook uh, Pro, I thought I would make the move from uh, from uh, Creative uh, Suite to Creative Cloud. So now, as of a couple days ago, I've gone totally uh, Creative Cloud on uh, Adobe Lightroom and Photoshop. I prepaid for a year, which is basically $119, 120 whatever, same thing. So now I have gone completely Creative Cloud on uh, Lightroom and uh, Photoshop. Uh, I don't know if uh, most of you use uh, Lightroom, but you should teach yourself how to use Lightroom. I mean, it you know drastically improves your workflow. You're actually able to do a lot of white balance and uh, creative work in uh, Lightroom. It's not the only application I use, but uh, how many of you out there actually uh, use uh, Creative uh, Suite? You still using Creative Suite, or have you switched over to Creative Cloud? You know, I, like I said, I just switched a few days ago, so I was a holdout. I didn't really want to switch to Creative Cloud, not for any reasons. I just don't like subscription services, and I know a lot of people don't like subscriptions. They're like, we're gonna, if you, you don't use it or not, we're still going to charge you. <laughs> it's like, you know, if you went on a vacation for three months, you're still being charged. <laughs> I know why that pisses some people off, and, you know, there's a right to be pissed off about that, but... Uh, It'd be great if you could just... Well, is that any different than... I don't know. They're giving you updates all the time. But, I mean, is that worth $120 a year? Is it really? If you're doing it as a as someone that's working with it, then, oh, hell yeah. I mean, it's just really, really cheap. If not, then you're probably going, no. No. So that's it. Adobe has gone now fully creative. You can't buy creative sweet stuff anymore unless you call into Adobe. But it is essentially not for sale anymore. So what did you uh, what did you think about that? Hmm? Yeah? 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 What? Good? Bad? No? Up, down, thumbs, this? I mean, are you like this to Adobe? Are you like this? Or are you like this? <laughs> you know what I mean? Thanks for watching. Creative Cloud. Their logo looks just like this, too. The Creative Cloud logo from Adobe. See? 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 It's a C and a C. Creative Cloud. Yeah. I think you got it already. Yeah. Okay. Bye.